What's up guys, Mike from Rockville, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up your RTP adjustable height totem stands. Now in this video, I'm going to be using the RTP 32W, but the instructions are going to apply to our RTP 82 series, which is just a taller totem stand adjustable from four feet and five inches to eight feet and two inches. Let's get to it. I like to start with building this from the bottom up. It's just a lot easier, especially if you're doing it by yourself. So you take one of the vertical beams. This opening is basically going to go over the two grooves that are over here. Put that over nicely. Now you're going to take the other side. Same thing. Then you're gonna take one of the horizontal beams here. This is actually going to work as one of the bridges between the two stands here. And what I like to do at this point is take one of the hand fastening bolts, put it into one of the holes and just get one nice and secure in. And you'll know when you catch because it'll eventually get too hard to turn. All right, cool, so I got one side in, cool. Now it's time to do the top plate. So you can actually see on the top of the totem there is the lip where the grooves on the top plate will actually sit. So you go ahead and you take the top plate and you just line it up with the lips on the vertical beams. There you go. So I take one of my hand tightening bolts, feed it through here, once you get one started, it's pretty easy. So you don't have to worry about the bridge falling off on one side. Groove. And at this point in the process, it's really up to you to make the decision on how you're going to use the totem stand. So if you're going to use it for a PA speaker, the next step would be to attach the 35 millimeter mounting pole onto the top. It's very simple. You take a hand fastening knob, feed it through the top hole here. You just go ahead and screw into that. The next decision you want to make with the totem stand is what color. So I'm gonna take the white scrim and I'll show you a really cool thing that you can do with it. So the way you put a scrim on is kind of just equivalent to how you would put a shirt on. Put it over top and drag it all the way through. I like to pull all the slack to the bottom. Now the cool thing is this scrim fits all the different sizes that you can raise this to. So if you're at 39 inches, which is what we're at right now, Perfect, if you go all the way up to 69 inches, the scrim is flexible enough to stretch with it. So I'm gonna show you something really cool that you can do when you have the white scrim off. So I have a rock par 50 here. So if I go ahead and actually put this in to the middle and leave it there, and I'll pull all the slack down so it's nice and neat you'll see that I have a column of light. So this is really cool for stages. If you're a DJ, you're throwing an event. So I have the Intimidator spot on and you can see that since it's an intelligent moving head, it kind of brings this totem to life. It's a really cool effect. I could actually combine this with the rock par and create an even bigger effect. So now I have the rock par back in the center of the totem and both of the lights are in sound activation mode. So if I go ahead and clap, that it's basically creating a light show just off of sound itself. So as you can see, the RTP32 series of totem stands are very versatile in how you can use them. You can use them with the white scrim and a rock part in the middle and create this nice column of light. They're perfect for putting any intelligent moving headlights on them, as well as for putting PA speakers on them. So hopefully this video showed you guys how easy it is to set up your RTP32 or RTP82 adjustable height totem stands. But again, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to reach out to our customer support tech team through phone or email. We'll see you guys in the next one.